one thing I do when I when I uh, pull weeds, and I have a, a sp as you can see, I've got a lot of weeds uh, on the left side here. This all is in flower, and I, I pretty much left it that way. So <coughs> as I pull and yank and and uh, probably leave a lot of root mass in the ground. These plants are uh, at their most vulnerable right now because they're putting flowers out and uh, the grasses too and uh, that seems to slow them down quite a bit when you when you pull weeds uh, like this. Uh, make sure that uh, you get a nice big crop of flowers before you pull them. This way the plant is at its most vulnerable and it's at its weakest because it's reproducing. The root is uh, fairly depleted of uh, re nutrients because it's producing flowers. So, uh, Also the smaller weeds and grasses that I pick as well as any other compostable material gets tossed in the, in the, in the walkway here. It gets trampled and it goes back to a a brown type of a material and in the fall I just rake it up throw it in the bed and it, uh, it composts down and goes back into the soil and feeds the ground for next year weeds are a very overlooked resource in the garden I feel uh, anyway have a good day